took me over a year to get the old memory back. I thought it was lost forever. Two years after the accident, I went back to see how the diving goes. Already on the third day of training, I went to record depths again. I feel more at home in the water. It's just wonderful. Free diving is uh, diving on a single breath. On land, you're in two dimensions, and in the water, you are 3D. I've done 33 world records in free diving. Just going as deep as you can, with weight, without weight, with fins, without fins, or just the longest time on the water. I was an airline pilot and I never knew about the sport at all. I was on a scuba diving safari and on the way there the airline lost my luggage with all the diving gear inside. So I was forced to snorkel and uh, leave the surface snorkeling just to taking pictures on the water and distracted taking pictures a friend was asking me how long can I go how deep can I go a few weeks after he called me up and said you know that you actually were only six feet short of the record I was fascinated by the fact I was just uh, seeing how far I can go every time I thought we reached a limit, there was a door, it opened, and the limit was gone. I got the nickname the deepest man on earth for the no limit record. It was 830 feet. The record itself, uh, everything in the beginning went fine. I went to do an anticipated depth, even a bit further, just to make sure I hit the, the mark. Then on the way up, I fell asleep. As you go deep, you get narcosis from the build of nitrogen in the body. It's like drinking too much alcohol. And this paired with being relaxed, I fell asleep. Without stopping, I went to the surface directly. So I, I didn't make the plant decompression stop. So I went immediately back down on pure oxygen. And there, at uh, nine meters, I felt the onset of decompression sickness. As a consequence, it was similar to having several brain strokes. They said I would be a wheelchair bound for life. It was actually better than I. I hoped I made my own routines to get better and healthy again and get it back my memory. I cannot imagine a life without diving. If you have seen that, you don't want to miss that. It's those moments interacting with marine life that make it also magic.